It's February 4th, 2023. I'm in a London student accommodation getting a panther tattoo in some very tasteful attire. Whilst my right bicep is being butchered by the tattoo gun, the music on Misha's computer changes to the next song. And whilst lying on the bed slash makeshift tattoo table, I'm greeted with a flurry of fireworks on the screen and an array of heavy synths. From that day onward, I've been completely enamored of the Detroit EDM duo, Snowstrikes. But just who are they? Tatiana Schwaninger and Graham Perez first met in Tatiana's home city of Clearwater, Florida, discovering the fact that they shared a lot of common interests during one of their first times hanging out at a sushi restaurant together. Graham being heavily inspired by rap music such as Lil Wayne's The Carter Free album and Black Cray. Tatiana having a love for J-pop music, such as Ayumi Hamazaki. Prior to their meeting, Graham also had experience working as a producer for different artists, according to their interview with ID Magazine. They'd begin moving between various cities as well, until eventually settling on Detroit, where they've now resided for the last three years. They'd start Snow Strippers as a duo in late 2021, with Graham as a producer and Tatiana providing vocals, releasing their first project, April Mixtape, in 2022 the first in the April Mixtape Trilogy. As of August 2023, they've released a total of five projects in over a year, producing a variety of genres ranging from chiptune, hardstyle, synthwave, and witch house. Many, in fact, comparing Snow Strippers to other groups in the Witch House genre before them, such as Crystal Castles, <laughs> Crimes, <laughs> and Salem. However, they prefer to call their music EDM. Their visual aesthetic derives from the indie sleaze era of the mid-2000s to early 2010s, which shows in the clothes they wear and the music videos that they film themselves, giving them full creative control of everything they make. They've even been photographed by the famous mid-2000s nightlife photographer, the Cobra Snake, further reinforcing their trashy indie sleaze aesthetic. They also apply elements of modern Americana, such as the trashy style of EDM music usually heard at Florida Spring Break, constant presentation of the American flag, materialism, guns, bikinis, and beer. All five top five slots of their Spotify monthly listeners are also from the USA. Do I need to continue? In their almost two year career, on top of releasing five projects, the duo have produced 22 music videos, been featured on the Year One label's Rift 2 mixtape, signed to New York collective and record label Surf Gang, and have worked with Lil Uzi Vert on a remix of their track, It's a Dream. The final track of April Mixtape 3 and Fire Alarm. The 16th track on Uzi's newest album, Pink Tape. They've also played free concerts in the US and Creepy TP Festival in the Czech Republic. There seems to be no sign of the duo stopping, and a tour is most certainly in order with the trajectory they're going at. So I'll end this video with one final sentence. I love snow strippers. <laughs>